Hi everybody, how you guys doing today? Today I am looking for chases in the wild. I, it's Saturday, I'm over here in Cedar Park and places I'm not gonna go to are GameStop, Hot Topic, FYE, because I know that the employees know too much about what a Funko is and it's very rare to be able to find one there. Now it's rare to find one anywhere, but I think when you look at those places, it's almost near impossible. So what I'm focusing on today is Walgreens. And I'm gonna hit some of the outer skirt ones, ones where hopefully the employees are just not too knowledgeable about what a Funko is. And maybe they'll get on the shelves. I know that they've recently restocked in a lot of these stores. And I heard there is some dwarves out there that have Chase uh, stickers on them. So let's go ahead and take a look and see what we can get out there. Hope you guys are having an awesome time. Let's see if we can get ourselves a freaking Chase today. I'm not even leaving the house. I'm leaving a Walgreens, but there was nothing in this particular one. And I knew there wouldn't be at this one. I knew this one got hit, got hit a lot. I'm gonna go to a different one. And it wasn't anything worth showing you guys. Like sometimes I'll show you guys the pops if there's anything like really interesting there. But uh, nothing majorly interesting at this particular location. All right, so we're leaving our second Walgreens. This time I showed you a little bit what was in there. This is actually kind of a score. I've been waiting forever to get myself my hands on a Green Lantern, a uh, Green Lantern at all. Any Funko Green Lantern. I haven't. I don't have any. I have some like combo ones. It's like Flash and Green Lantern, but they really don't look like Green Lantern. I finally got Green Lantern. This is the first time I've seen it at a Walgreens, so it's not. It's pretty to me. They're pretty rare. I only bought one since I'm not like doing that many giveaways anymore, but uh, happy to have it. Now I bought this because I really wanted it, not because I thought it was going to go up in value or anything like that. And I think you got to go with that frame of mind when you buy stuff at Walgreens or any of these places because they will restock them. Like stuff like the glow in the dark Yoda that Walgreens used to have, it was kind of rare. Now it's, all, you know, I see it in a lot of stores, they just restock them because people want them and I can't blame them for doing it. It's a good money maker for them. From a collectible perspective, it's not as good, but uh, hey, it's okay, you know? So I also saw Scarlet Witch, as you, if you saw the video and I picked it up and looked at it, but when I was sticking to the register, I saw quite a bit of box damage on the top of it. There was a huge thick crease on it and the box was bent. So I decided to return that one back even though I was tempted to get it. I figured let me push my luck and let's go to another Walgreens and let's see what actually happens. Let's see if we can find ourselves something good. Dorbs wise I was expecting to find more dorbs but I haven't seen that much. Mostly they've been Disney ones. Um, I thought I know there's some um, I think there's some X-Men ones out there also. So I haven't seen them but I think they're out there. Those are the ones I know for sure have a chase in them. Uh, so we'll see what we can find but number two Walgreens down and I'm not completely it's not going the way I'm hoping but it's okay this is part of you know doing hunting hunting is like this the thrill of it if it was easy like your first hit you're gonna get something great then you're delusional especially if you're looking for a chase chase you know there might only be one if you're lucky in 20 stores, 20 different Walgreens, and I'm not gonna hit 20 Walgreens, so it's it's gonna be a, a very random, difficult thing, and I don't have high hopes of doing it, but it does kill time. And since I drive a Prius, it doesn't cost me that much in terms of gas or anything else on my car. It just costs me time, which I don't really have anything planned today. So that's part of the, part of the fun and chase, you know, pop collecting and stuff like that. So if you like Funko Pops, you like collecting, going out there and actually looking for it yourself I mean it's easy to buy the stuff online but going out there and do it actually you get the best deals because if you can find like an exclusive or a chase that might have a little value at least initially you know you got something that you bought it for cost um, and it's something you really wanted too. like you know the, the Green Lantern one I'm sure is worth more than $10 if I go on eBay or something to get it so for me to be able to get it for, for what it costs is always a good thing even if it's only worth $10 and you know five or six months it's still worth it because that's all that i invested in my time in it um so anyway 
that's it for number two let's move on to number three this one's a little bit out so i will restart the video when i get out there and hopefully we can find ourselves some more pots maybe the scarlet witch i didn't even know that this the green lantern and that scarlet witch were out to be honest with you i knew they were coming but since i had looked at walgreens in the past and i haven't seen them like i think I, last week i looked and there was nothing there i just assumed that there's no they weren't out yet and apparently i was wrong so anyhow let's continue with this journey left the last Walgreens I'm going to I think I went to like five I didn't find any chases I found some pops which is really cool but I only ended up buying one pop I didn't get the uh, Scarlet Witch I, I saw one and it was in decent condition but uh yeah I didn't I don't really like it that much I mean I like I like to have it but at the same time I don't love it you know and that's the thing is if I don't love it then I really shouldn't buy it if I don't love it, you know. Uh, so that's it for my haul today. I don't think I'm going to stop anywhere else. I'm just going to go home. So I got the Green Lantern. As you can see, when we went through it, through the different places, there's probably, I don't know how many there is. I'm gonna, I'll am gonna, i put it on the screen here once I get it all counted up. But I think I counted, I think that we had at least 15 or 20 of them that we saw. They were pretty, uh, well, some, they were pretty abundant in all the stores. So it wasn't something that was super rare. So I'm okay with it. I'm glad I just bought one and I'm happy I have it because I don't have a Green Lantern in my collection and I like that Green Lantern. I think it looks pretty freaking awesome. So I'll give you all a close up of it in the video here when you see it here in a second. 